morning besties it's a new day and first things first my daily dose of this beautiful amazing views so today we had planned to go to the dunes and later go to the bungalow and we're just gonna have breakfast a little bit of swimming just before we get ready for dunes because our dunes is at uh, 12 today our appointment is for 12 and then we plan to go to the bungalow later at around half five to six well today none of us felt like cereal so we decided to make full breakfast our eggs pancakes bangers just to feed our cravings Today we got into some teamwork because we were starving and my room was to vlog. <laughs> so we then went for a quick swim and one thing I loved about this accommodation is the heated pool because the weather in Cape Town and the water in Cape Town is extremely cold. So I loved that about this accommodation. So now I'm getting ready for our biking, our quad biking at Dunes, which is for 12 o'clock. But somehow we were all late because we thought that our appointment was for 1 o'clock. So mind you, the time right now is quarter to 12. This is us with some boomerangs because we thought we were early. And then we met this man. Guys, I love the honesty. It is so cool. I just love the honesty. He didn't really have to try putting any effort. He wanted what he wanted. It's quarter to one and we are on our way for quiet biking at Dunes. But now we got turned away because of the time issue. I don't know how somehow all of us were convinced that our booking was for one, but none of us actually checked. It was actually for 12. So we got turned away. We had to book another slot. Unfortunately, all the slots for the day were already booked. So <laughs> we had to like opt for one that was in like two days. We then decided to go to Kemp's Bay, just explore and take pictures. And then we just waited for our reservation at the bungalow. Yeah, we really didn't have much planned for the day. Besides, we just did a, just a nice short tour and went back to Indlini. <laughs> It's 5 o'clock and now we are at the bungalow. This place is really beautiful. The sunset, I cannot wait for the sunset. That's one thing I was really looking forward to. So we ordered our drinks. We had to change our spot. The one that we initially were placed in wasn't the ideal one for us because we didn't really have a full view of the sunset. But luckily we were able to get a spot that we loved and the food was amazing the drinks were amazing the ambience was beautiful i really enjoyed i enjoyed the bungalow no wonder and i guys as per usual doing the dance whatever <laughs> that we saw on tiktok and it was not tiktoking but bungalow was amazing it was beautiful <laughs> So here I was calling out these two, they're busy on their phones looking at the pictures that we just took trying to pose and I was telling them that let's just enjoy the moment, we'll do that later when you go to bed or whatever. So I need you guys to drag them in the comment section because I'm the mother of the group. I'm the mother of the group. Otherwise everything was went perfectly um, fine and the drinks were really amazing. So this is the food that we ordered which is really really good. I definitely recommend the bungalow and we spent like roughly I think we spent four hours at the bungalow. That's how amazing it was and yeah that was it for our day. So when we got back to the villa we had to plan for the other day since there was a change of plan with the dunes and everything and then we went to sleep. 
it's a beautiful morning we just made breakfast we took our time today we made breakfast and we are having a slow day we don't want to go out the house today so we decided to just chill in our villa enjoy our villa um, take some content just laze around and have a slow day because we've been doing the ups and downs the activities exploring the tours so today was just dedicated to just enjoying the villa and not leaving the house so we just hung around and fixed our meals took pictures just enjoyed our own company It's a new day and I decided to go for a morning swim. The weather wasn't the best so Unogwa and Nutando Abafunanga like they didn't want to join me in the pool. So if you know me, you know how I like my morning swims. I must say the weather was really cold so I got out of the pool and ran for the dear warm shower. <laughs> So today we were quite lazy to make breakfast so we fixed ourselves some leftovers from last night before heading to the beach and the weather had improved very much that's why we ended up uh, going to the beach at least once during our stay because we were lazy the whole time but the weather was then beautiful. Yo the stairs get Godwa. Never again guys never again. We had a great time at the beach even though we did not swim because the water was extremely cold. I bet the temperature was less than 1 degree Celsius. Ain't no way. So we got back to the house, we got ready, we had made a reservation at the Cabo Beach Club and we were running a bit late but we just made it, I think we were like 10 minutes late which is not so bad. We're now at the Cabo Beach Club and <laughs> the grand entrance, darling. This place is more of relaxed and laid back. I love that about it. It is the type of place that you would go to just to unwind and reconnect with self kind of vibes it's beautiful and the food also was quite good the chicken wings were out of this world amazing i'm not a seafood person i decided to try out ostriches for the first time and you know what never again bye when it comes to money and they concentrate Make I tell you straight, you are not my bitch If you become a shit, I'll be head of state From the people, then go say, I know one guy I know one guy Tando and I decide to step into the pool And right now, we're freezing to death Ain't no way The water temperature maybe was again i think below one degree celsius and as you can see it's just only us in the pool no one else the water is extremely cold extremely cold we are now at vna waterfront for our boat cruise we had made a reservation for the afternoon sunset boat cruise Step out, 
I really enjoyed myself. I enjoyed the cruise. I enjoyed the views. Cape Town is so beautiful. The sunset. If you know me, I'm such a sunrise and sunset kind of person. I will definitely do this again. So after our boat cruise, we decided to head to Ayepi just for the experience. It's a new day and it is our last day in Cape Town. So as per usual, you guys already know it, my daily dose of the breathtaking view. I decided to go sit there alone and meditate because the space was allowing. So because our flights were a bit late, today was the day we had postponed our quiet biking too. So we are headed to the quiet biking at the dunes. So this time around, we're like an hour early. We know one dynamic, guys. You already know it. So we really enjoyed our quiet biking, even though we felt like extending the time a bit. But okay, the time was not permitting because we also had flights to catch later. And we already know that the airport is going to be packed because it's a long weekend. So that's it, guys. I hope you enjoyed our vlog. See you next time. Bye.